Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Dynasty Wrestling World. We're here in Newark, New Jersey. Starting things off with, the, with still your world heavyweight champion. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the Dynasty Wrestling World Heavyweight Champion, the Slasher, Matthew Hilton. Let's hear what he has to say to Jimmy Joe and Cotton Terry. Sunday hurt. It did. I walked in thinking, I knew it was going to be a challenge. I didn't know what number I was going to draw. So I was in there for a good long while before I won. But man, was that a tough challenge. Eight of seven of the best dynasty wrestlers challenging for the top prize. They all gave it their all, yet they all came up short. So what do you do? I thought, what do you do when your top guys, none of them can take the belt off you? So I started thinking with Max Bryant, the general manager. I started thinking and thinking, and then I thought to myself, let's have a four-way here tonight in our main event. Four guys I have never had a one-on-one -on -one match with. So we thought of four guys who I've never fought. And we put them all in a four-way match for tonight's main event. And the winner of that match will face me in a couple weeks for the Dynasty World Heavyweight Championship. Here are your four competitors. Angel Dumming. Former three-time junior heavyweight champion. Former two-time world tag team champion. Super trios winner. Dude has it all. He has, like, the most wins out of anyone in the dynasty era. He has surpassed 20 wins. So that was an obvious pick. Up next is Cameron Bash. Doesn't have a good win-loss record, but he has held the distinction of having won the World Cup. Not only that, but this match would be, let's just say, five years in the making. Gavin Saban, former World Heavyweight Champion, United States Champion, two-time Hardcore Champion. Gavin Saban. I fought the other two members of the Brotherhood. I have not fought Gavin. Though he doesn't have a great win-loss record currently, and he hasn't been on a roll recently, we put him in that match because I want to say that I fought all the Brotherhood. And finally, Nicholas Boyd. Kid just started wrestling this year. Had his first match this year and has been on a tear ever since. Two-time legacy champion. Two-time. He lost it on Sunday. But he's held that belt twice. And he entered the Demolition Derby. He didn't win. 
couldn't retain his belt. But let's face it, this kid knows his shit. Plus, he's the son of Drew Boyd, who was one of the seven men I beat at Demolition Derby. So, that is your main event. Those four men competing for a spot to face me. And of course, not to be outdone, but there's another issue that happened at Demolition Derby. That Antonio Sullivan was attacked the night before at, on Dynasty Wrestling World and was not cleared to compete. The man that apparently attacked him was Robert Cruz, who would go on to enter that match and be the runner-up. That Demolition Derby match would be the runner-up. So to make it up to Antonio, Antonio Sol later tonight, Antonio Sullivan will take on Robert Cruz. We got a lot of action, so I'm not going to waste any more of your time. And hope you guys enjoy the rest of the show. And remember, no one. To all four guys that are in that four-way, that four-way is going to be the easiest match you have. Because guess what? Ain't no way in hell are any of you beating me. Those are the words of Matthew in that four-way, the main event tonight. Let's get to our first match. Time for our first contest. This contest stood up for by Jesus Christ. He is one half of the Dynasty World Tag Team Champion. Knee Strike, Johnny Grant. Bad Beast Green. Opponent representing the kingdom, the case
show winner in 15 minutes, 23 seconds, the Everything I do so instinctive and so passionate Every word I move so descriptive like an adjective I got a vendetta against people who patented it Being negative, damn it, you should be getting after it I got facts over facts over tracks this Jordan's checking on his father Hey wait, Zelene's attacking Jordan! Wait, the rest of the kingdom out here attacking Jordan Grant. This is turned into a beatdown. Wait a minute, Zalik. Throwing Jordan into the kingdom? Oh, Castle Crasher. And wait, one more Castle Crasher on Johnny now. I could guess, think I'm okay at last, but I don't know what The kingdom laying waste to the tag team champions. We got another match. But first, we hear from Chris Danger. <laughs> Didn't I tell you guys that Johnny Gallius wasn't ready? For me he should have just stayed home that night that way he wouldn't have been embarrassed in madison square garden losing his junior heavyweight championship which is now rightfully mine thank you thank you johnny i warned you not to come for me i warned you and now look what's happened your little baby is mine Let's just say, with you out hurt, I'm going to take real good care of this until you get back, and if you want it to. Because, Johnny, I'm better than you in every way, Johnny Gallion. I am better than you. You are my protege. I taught you quite a bit. I didn't teach you everything, because if I had taught you everything, I wouldn't have walked out junior heavyweight champion. So, with that said, the question is, who's my next opponent? I don't really know, and I don't really care, because at the end of the day, it doesn't matter. I will still be junior heavyweight champion, no matter what. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for some women's action. This one has good of one ball to this first. The Death Match Princess. Bam! Amy! Haven't seen her in a while. Good is to have her back. But the question is, we don't know her opponent. And her opponent, Akira Kiyoshi. The one woman Layla Siren hasn't beaten. Layla 
the Siren hasn't beaten Akira Kiyoshi. But they fought once and Akira Kiyoshi picked up the win at the LAW Dynasty. All that war, man. Thank you. 
your winner in 21 minutes, 17 seconds, Akira Kiyoshi. Sending a message to Layla Siren, who is watching backstage. What a women's match. It looks like we know what Akira wants. It's time to get to our next contest. Johnny Adrian wants to say he had the best performance of the night. That's what he's going around social media saying that he should have won. He had the best performance out of everybody in that match. Well, I got some news for you. Let me remind you, Johnny, who had two matches that night, retained his title in one, and then entered the world. That same match you're talking about? Yeah. I. I think it's safe to say that I had the best performance that night. But if you want to prove me wrong, show up to Dynasty next week, face me one-on-one, -on -one, and I'll put my Global Japan Universal Championship on the line. Like I always do. Because unlike you, I'm not afraid to defend the title. I'm not. So, what's going to be, Johnny? You're going to stay behind your screens like a little bitch or are you going to answer the challenge it's up to you ladies and gentlemen it's time for our next contest It's called a skin pump on. This is where it is. The Italian Psycho. Antonio Sullivan. His opponent, the tank, Robert Cruz.
your winner in 15 minutes, 30 seconds, Robert Cruz. Victory for Robert. This contest is a tag team match introducing various the team of Justin and Jordan, the Lance Brothers.
and their opponents, the team of Jaden Wilson and Aaron West, Cody Dalton.
minutes and 23 minutes, 8 seconds, party. Delta! Party Delta! Picks up the victory! And wait the Lance Brothers! From behind! Attacking Party Delta! And a powerbomb to Aaron West and a powerbomb to Jaden Wilso! Oh, here comes the legacy champion, Young East! The legacy champion! Taking it to the Lance Brothers! Kicks Justin down, and down goes Jaden! Young Ace! And, oh, he just met a wall! A wall ironically named Aaron Wheeler. Oh, God. Wheeler choke slammed a young ace. And Aaron Wheeler has picked up the legacy title. Oh, I think I know what Aaron Wheeler wants now. It's the Dynasty Legacy Championship. That's not even going to fit around his waist. So we know what Aaron Wheeler wants now. We got to get into our main event. Time for the main event. Four-way, where to get the world that way, bad opportunity. This contest is a great four way. The winner facing Matty O'Neill. Here we time for the World Heavyweight Championship. Raising first. Representing best in the universe. The GOAT. Angel Dominguez. Representing A Wall, the Warrior Champion, Bash!
compare number three. Representing the Brotherhood, the anti hero, Gavin Saban. Competitor. Representing the Wolfpack, the future, Nicholas Boyd.
your winner in 15 minutes, 48 seconds, and number one contender for the Dynasty World Heavyweight Championship, Nicholas Boy. Matthew Hilton applauding backstage. And now Matthew Hilton has walked to the stage applauding. From the legacy title, the possible world heavyweight championship. What a four way! Thank you for joining us here tonight. Matthew and Nicholas Boyd face to face. And that's what it'll be about. The World Heavyweight Championship. Thank you for joining us here tonight in Newark, New Jersey. We'll see you next week.